As these airports work to overcome challenges with delays and cancellations, our Demetrius Sanders joins us live at Peoria International Airport now. Demetrius, what are travelers there saying about their experiences? Well, Mark, local travelers say they're happy to see the schedule here at PIA showing that flights are on time and on schedule. This is even more true as thousands elsewhere face some serious travel issues. Wednesday afternoon, crowds of travelers flying in and out of Peoria International Airport, many of those flying reporting no significant issues. I went to Florida to visit my daughter. She invited me down for Christmas. We're from St. Petersburg, Florida, and uh, we're just here to visit family. Southwest Airlines, which accounts for the vast majority of U.S. flight cancellations, doesn't have service in Peoria, but local travelers say seeing others have challenges did make them pay more attention to their flight updates. I checked to make sure that everything was still on time and okay. To avoid the hassle of holiday flight issues, some rearranging their plans. Last year we were trying to come prior to Christmas and we missed our flight. So this year we decided to come for New Year and go after the holidays. Others preparing to board flights on Wednesday say they didn't have major concerns as their travel plans normally go without a hitch. Well, I definitely didn't want to check any bags. I knew that. Um, but you know, I've always had, I've always been lucky going back and forth between Austin and Peoria. And flyers at PIA say they're feeling grateful considering the experience others have faced. I'm just glad that we've been spared the worst of it. Now, according to the flight tracking website FlightAware, there's only been two delays coming in or out of Peoria today. For now, reporting live in Peoria, Demetria Sanders, WMBD News.